right that way to that corner. All right, you guys. I got another video for you. Beautiful. All right, you guys. Well, I just walked back here, and if you guys remember, I had the Herman tortoises here, and I have a very large male adult cicada tortoise that sits in the front yard, and somehow, I guess the gate was unlocked. She pushed through. He pushed through, and decided to hit this area over here because there's always something here at Blake's Exotic Animal Ranch. She, he hit this rhino enclosure cage, destroyed that thing. Well, didn't destroy it, but bent it all up. And as you guys can see, I had the temporary enclosure here. Came in here, knocked everything down. Came over here and started digging. And um, I have 10 Herman tortoises in here, 4.6. And as of right now, I see only three. So I have seven tortoises missing right now. So now we're gonna have to go on a hunt. And again, not planned at all. Another tortoise escaped. Not cicada tortoises this time, Herman tortoises. So let's go look around and go on a tortoise hunt on very nice tall grass that I haven't cut for a very long time. And there you go. My mom's already on the hunt and she just found one. Bring it over here. We need 10 total and we have three in here right now. So let's set it all back up. Put these guys back in. That makes four. There you go. Let's screw all that back together. What do you have right there? Is that a female or a male? What is this? What is this? A hermit tortoise. All right, but is it male or female? Yes. Male. You suck. It's a female. Come on now. I thought I taught you better. This is a female hermit tortoise. And a big tail. That's a small tail. Hershey kiss tail. Come on now. Big tail's a male. That's a male. All right, so we have a pair right now. This is another male. And we have, all right, another male right here. So we need to go find more, you guys. There's a lot more to go find. Hopefully we find them all. Let's set this back up real quick. This little shade thing I made. Hold that down. There you go. You're good. I won't get your fingers in front Perfect. All right, now we're gonna go on the hunt, you guys, to go look for these guys. God, I say you guys a lot, don't I? What you seen here, Herman, female we just got, and then, uh, we got another beautiful female right there. All right, so how many do we have now? I lost count already? Eight. We have eight. We have nine, ten. Nine, ten, nine, ten. Let's look around in here, you guys. They definitely probably strange each other all around in here. Find another one right underneath that that wheelbarrow. Oh, the other way. Yeah. Oh. All right, cool. So, so we're now we're just missing one. Missing one, and I think it's a female. This is another female right here. So at least it didn't go too far. Let's see where it went. Probably just all around here somewhere. Go through on this thing, underneath this thing. A little bit, yeah. Ugh. Oh. At least the rhino cage didn't get that beat up that it didn't open up or anything that they got out. So, I mean, it's bent up and stuff, but that's all right. It's fine. All right, let's look around here. See if we find another female. Oh, did I step on something? Nope. So this is like a little spot right there. It was digging and hiding, but it's not there. This one's going to be forever to find, probably. Watch. Two came this far. Yeah, I look pretty good down. Hey, right here. Oh, the cameraman found them, you guys. He found them. Perfect, beautiful, awesome. I walked right by that thing. And the last female. Awesome, you guys. So now, what we're gonna have to do. Let's go get Big Man, this monster, ginormous, adult male cicada tortoise. You guys think Max is big? Max is small compared to this monster over here that I got donated to me. His name, not 100% sure what it is, but I call him Big Boy. He's a 28-year-old 
ginormous adult male Scott, a 30 inch straight line, meaning measured top to bottom underneath. Huge male. We'll go check him out right now once we put her back there. Missy. Everyone's back into the little home right now. Cool, cool beans. Awesome. Let's go get big boy now. I see how much this wheelbarrow is. It was $130. Now let's walk over here. You're good, don't worry. Willie's all right. That monster right there, you guys, I'm telling you, monster. This Lucata tortoise is literally a monster and does not like people. He is a very aggressive male. He's not a breeder, but he's literally a monster. And um, yeah, he's 130 pounds also. And Willie is watching Dylan right now, and it's not fun. But we're gonna get this big boy out, get him onto that wheelbarrow, and it's a gorilla cart, meaning it says he can hold 1,200 pounds. So hopefully it doesn't break. Hopefully uh, Nick doesn't have to buy me a new one. Yeah, you're welcome, Nick. I put your name in here. As you guys see in this video, Crazy things happen every single day. I literally just walked back here to go get the wheelbarrow to go feed some tortoises. Gucci gang was following me and that happened. So we're gonna pull this thing out right now. He is a monster. He doesn't like to get pulled. Ugh. Big guy, all right. Look at this guy, you guys, monster. Monster, literally a monster. Push him out a little bit more and then we're gonna get somebody else to video camera this and we're gonna Wow, you know I just noticed right now to you guys? This thing is 28 years old, still a young man. You know why I say that? Let's look closely. See those white lines right there? You know what those means? He's still growing. He is still growing, still getting bigger, and he can probably get twice this size. These are the third largest tortoises in the world, you guys, so that's why I say make sure you guys do your research because these things get humongous. So let's get this guy inside the wheelbarrow. All right, he fits perfectly. God, that thing's a monster. All right, let's go take him to his home where he's supposed to go. All right, pull it up. And now we're gonna take him to where he's supposed to go. How much do you think he weighs? Uh, just go straight. Hey, 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 hey. Thank you. Oh man, how much does he weigh? <laughs> Use your muscles. Probably over 130 pounds, I'll tell you that much. But let's take him. I didn't think he was going to fit inside of here. Straight that way to that corner. Ready? I have to lift him up and pull him first. Alright, one, two. Ah. Right there. You good? Oh. Your finger's not crushed? Good. Alright, we're good. Alright. Because if you guys, if you grab them, you see some people grabbing giant large staccatos on the sides right here. Oh, he's going home. He knows exactly where he's at. You grab them right here on the sides, and what happens is those skin, the very rough skin, messes you up and it does not feel good at all. If you grab him in the front, he has no problem. And you guys see, his home was right there in the corner. He knows exactly where he's at. He is very happy to go back. So that is awesome. He is going right home. Right into his house, like I told you guys. He is really happy to go back in. This is his home. These, the people that gave him to me, they're very close friends with me. And this guy, has lived in here since he was a little guy and he would graze around in their property, but they didn't want to keep him anymore because he just got so big for them. And I said that I would take him in. And he knows this is his home and he is happy as can be to be back into his home. But he grazes the whole property. All that, that's all his. So he definitely has a very big yard. All right, you guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this video today here at Blake's Exotic Animal Ranch. Like I said, there's always different things happening here every day. Sometimes I don't even have to plan the videos noises and everything happens here all the time so get used to it you guys get used to all the noises because we're on a ranch and there goes Scotty and benny i will see you guys tomorrow and thank you for watching